Hey guys, VG Maniac 456 here, and welcome back to some more Donkey Kong Country Returns! Right, so last time we completed the Forest World! Next time, or this time, we're gonna complete the Cliff World, which I constantly call it the Canyon World for whatever reason. Starting off with Sticky Situation, I think we can already guess what this one's gonna be. Now, personally, I must admit something. I really think that these levels onwards are gonna end up having too much of a nostalgic feeling for me for whatever reason, even though this game's only three years old. Um, mainly because of what happened three years ago. I'd rather not explain what exactly happened three years ago, but you know, it, the game was released and I remember these levels pretty well. Like, totally well. And again, I don't really want to mention what exactly happened three years ago. It's sort of dumb and such. Uh, regardless, though, let's get to this bonus level coming on right now. Oh, oh no, it's not a bonus level, it's a puzzle piece. Okay, that works. As long as it's a puzzle piece, that's all that really matters. That's really all that matters, as long as it's a puzzle piece. And I didn't waste my time. And yes, this is Tar, and in order to get it off, you just... Oh, get it off of you, you just pound the ground a lot. Shake the Wiimote, or Wiimote. None of the truck, if that's the control scheme you're going for. And... Yeah, this, this world might be your first hard world in the game. Just pointing that out. Put it a little loud on my headset so that way I can hear it, just to make sure there's not going to be any skips. For some reason, I keep putting the slider a little bit lower. Why do I keep dying on the stupidest spots? The worst spots ever. Let's just grab Diddy and be on our way. Get rid of this flamethrower, fireball, skeleton, dinosaur thing that's on a cart for whatever reason. And be on our way because unfortunately I don't want to actually get bitten by its skeleton heads that don't really make any sense to even be in here. Is there anything down here? No, there isn't. I forget which one it is. It's not that one, though. Okay. Can that skeleton please get out of my way? Thank you. Coins are pointless, so I'm not gonna grab them. I'm honest with you, I'm not gonna get the coins. And I'm not gonna even try grabbing coins anymore. Also, there's a puzzle piece right here. By the way, if you stay in the tar for too long, it actually makes you sing, so instant death. Just thought I would let you know about that. Oh yeah, and then there's the down there, so let's go ahead and wrap that. Why did I do that? Oh, well, that's actually useful. I could probably just jump up there. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, the puzzle piece is down here. Kind of invisible from sight. And there's nine puzzle pieces in this world. I think that's gonna be a common theme in this world. There's gonna be nine. I can't remember if there's anything up there or not. I'm gonna check. No, there is not. Just thought I would check. Uh this becomes a little tricky. Utilize the frame. Uh, uh bah, yeah. Utilize the invisibility frames, and then go into the bonus level because that's actually very sneaky. Let's fail this time. Like I said, there's a pattern to this where you don't have to move so much. But again, it's been way too long since I've played this game, so I don't quite remember the pattern. Which is no good! No good at all! Whee! I'm being a little bit hyperactive today, aren't I? Oh fudge, oh crud, oh fudge, oh crud. 
Up him. Up him. Up him. Up him. Up fudge. Up fudge. Up fudge. Let's grab this G. And then be an arm. Not so merry way because the uh, OG's oh, oh crud, oh fudge, oh fludge, oh crud. Okay, I'd rather get hit. Because getting hit means that I'm still alive. As long as I don't die right here. Okay, grab that puzzle piece and booyah. Also, there's a puzzle piece over there, so I gotta make sure I don't die right there. Okay, that's actually useful. Yeah, I didn't I don't really care. I'm actually being honest with you, I don't really care anymore. <laughs> DK, coin, bananas, life. Doesn't really matter anymore. I got 99 lives anyways. Okay, if you can tell prehistoric paths is gonna be none other than a Minecraft. Didn't I say that last time on Minecraft level? I swear, I think I did say that. I think I did say Minecraft level when I meant to say Minecart. By the way, there's a none other than a special bonus level right here. Which is gonna be the one that I always think I'm gonna hit my head on. It seems not retro seems to like this one a lot. In every single level, I swear. Every single world, I mean. Not a world level, because we know it's not in every single level. You can check every single part in this Let's Play to find out that it's in every single world or level. Actually, I could probably figure that out on my own, but I'm pretty certain it is in every single world. Okay. Jeez. Oh, fudge. Oh, crud. Oh, jeez. Come on. Thank you, good grief. Finally, we're on the minecart part. Which is relatively difficult, I guess. It's a minecart level. What else do you want to... For your birthday? You know, I was actually gonna say that. What else do you want for your birthday? I don't know why, it just felt like... Hey, why don't you just say that, EG? Why don't you say, what else do you want for your birthday? Okay, I finally didn't get hit. Yes, Tar is in synthet, if you can tell. Also... Oh yeah, I did that perfectly last and perfectly this time. Last time I didn't do it perfectly. Some of these minecart levels are pretty... are pretty cleverly designed. Can't really deny that. Except when you do stupid stuff like that! Is it anyways? It's up here. Wee! Woohoo! Woohoo! Duck! Goose! Duck! Goose! Jump! Oh boy! Woohoo! Jump! Jump! Jump for victory! Woohoo! Woohoo! Woo! Woo! No! Woo! Okay. Enough excitement. Yep. Boom! 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 Oh. Woo! That was close. Like, oh my gosh. So much excitement! You can't stand it, right guys? I mean, you want to get this game right now for your Nintendo Wii or Nintendo 3DS. Actually, if by the time I probably get this up, it's probably available on the 3DS and probably by then you guys will probably say, oh, well, yeah, the 3DS version is better because of the controls. Well, honestly, I won't know, but I'm very certain that the 3DS version is gonna be better, will have better controls because no motion controls. Gosh, that's the one problem I have about this game. I really love the Donkey Kong Country games and all, but honestly, 
This is one that... Okay, I actually cheated the level. You're not supposed to actually do that. You're supposed to... Um, you know, kill the enemy first and then... And then actually go on there, but that works too, I guess. Whatever works. Whatever works in game. Oh no! There's a checkpoint there too. Yeah, um... In case you didn't see, there was a puzzle piece in a cannon right there, so I'm gonna have to grab it. 400% playthrough! As you guys already know, I do 100% playthroughs on my Let's Plays most of the time. Unless it's like Kirby's Adventure, then I didn't exactly do 100% playthrough because, you know... I didn't do the extra bonus stuff. No, it was because I wanted to get the Let's Play out of the way. Done and out of the way, because, you know... It was kind of glitched off with my silly save for some reason or another. It didn't save what I needed to do, what it needed to save for whatever reason. My save was just deleted off. That's the life of an emulator. So now with the Kirby's uh, Dream Collection, I could probably do a better Let's Play of that if I wanted to, but I'm not going to because. I don't know, it just feels a little silly to do a let's play of a game that I've already done a let's play of. Don't you guys agree? Don't you guys think that doing a let's play of, a, of the same game twice is a little bit redundant? Also, I think there is a cheap way to get past this, and I don't think... Ah, dang it. Ah, boom. Okay. Uh, oh man. The weights are. Okay, come on. Let's go. I don't know. I really love the atmosphere of these levels for some reason. They're very atmospheric, I guess. You know, it's something weird that I like about them. Sort of like the Ruins World. I kind of like those in, by the atmosphere as well. How many checkpoints are there? Did Retro really think that you guys would fail on this? Good grief. That's what an easy mode would be like. And this is an actual game on the Wii. I mean, seriously. This is not like some kind of shovelware game. No, this is actually a good game. This is actually a game by Retro. And Retro does excellent games. I hope they do a sequel for this game because honestly, it's a very, very good game. Darn it. Played this level again because of the, so the puzzle piece that I missed. You don't need that silly weight. What was what were they thinking when they designed this level? Maybe they were just thinking about a speed run. I don't know. Oh yeah, and then there's this puzzle. There's this Kong letter. Ignoring that. Whee! Yeah, and then there's this. Yeah, you. Puzzle piece. And then there's that last one that I missed, so... I'll see you when I get it. Because it's not really that far away. And I did it again. I moved to volume slider. I hate it when I do stuff like that. Because I want to make sure it doesn't... I didn't want to mean to push continue. Oh my gosh, I'm doing two things wrong here. Yeah, I might as well buy the key while I'm at it. <laughs> Supposedly, there's actually a weird glitch where you, Cranky's shop will not deload or whatever. Also, that level is actually relatively easy, so it's not going to be a big bother. Uh, okay, thank you. <laughs> it was, as soon as I was saying that Cranky Shop sometimes glitches up and freezes up and doesn't let you go, it does that. Like, really. Seriously, game? Okay. If I could pass this 
pick it past us, this is going to be absolutely amazing. Okay, this is not going to be good. Okay, here is the silly puzzle piece, and I'll see you in the next level. Which will take a little while. So yeah, see you then. Okay, which level's next? Oh no, this one's next. Boulder Rolder! I like how they rhymes, or they start with the f with a specific letter. Start with the same letter. It's always that. I don't know why, it just is. This level in particular I remember the most. Because I remember trying to complete it in mirror mode, and this was absolutely atrocious to do. And you'll find out why. Yeah, boo. Okay. Ew! Yeah, go. Already, I'm having troubles. Ah, go, 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 go. Ow! Do, 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 do. Not good. Not good. Not good. Not good. Not good. Not good. Yeah, he responds. That's good. Oh, and the platform responds. Okay. That's very useful. Why'd you commit suicide, you skeleton? That was silly of it. I swear, that tar really looks like chocolate. No wonder I'm getting hungry. I keep thinking it looks like chocolate. Dark chocolate. Yum. How many of you guys actually like dark chocolate? That's actually a good question. I don't know. Actually, that's a silly question. Why does... Okay, that's obvious I'm running out of topics if I'm talking about... Who likes dark chocolate? Really? Really, VG? Is that really all you can think of? Who likes dark chocolate? Okay, the, I thought it was frame skipping, but it's not. And I almost did the same thing over again. Oh, you son of a thing. Skeleton. Uh, son of an Arceus, I guess. I know. That's what I used to say, son of an Arceus. Not that I really slang that much anymore, anyways. I kind of stopped slanging because of habit. I don't remember when I used to slang a lot. I used to slang up a lot. Okay, will it... Should I check? I might want to check. Hold on one sec. I'm gonna check. Okay, it's not frame skipping. It's just the sound is being a little off for whatever reason. I guess it's like... I guess it's being a little laundry today. Okay, nothing over there. Yep. You see, this is not really that hard, and I didn't really- m I think I may have already mentioned it, but mirror mode, you have only one hit point, everything is mirrored. Well, the part that's mirrored is not that bad, I don't know why that part would actually matter at all. But, um, what does matter is the fact that you only got one hit point, and you don't have Diddy at all. That was close for my taste. Too many close calls already. How did I go? How did I roll underneath him? I gotta check that out. So I rolled underneath him, I swear. Uh, uh, no, just a single banana. There's a puzzle piece right here, so that doesn't really matter. Oh, fudge, oh, fudge, oh, fudge, oh, fudge. Oh, fudge. And checkpoint. Awesome. And there's that boulder again. Yep. Mm -hmm. Okay. Up. Oh, Up. Oh, nope. This is the part I was talking about. The part that it actually becomes a pretty annoying. This is not actually the area in general, but it's the kind. It's the same kind of general idea because it's a little bit silly. It's this one. I can never, almost never pass this without getting hit. Except, for, I mean, it's really precise. And I did it again. Except, remember, you don't have Diddy Kong. So, since you don't have Diddy Kong, it becomes really precise. Because Donkey Kong's roll is a little... Oh my gosh, this is... You better not have claustrophobia. Yeah, because that's actually pretty... Difficult. Also, I always thought this was the area that you're supposed to go. It's only there for... I think it's... It's only there for the puzzle piece. And... 
Let's grab the coin. 666. Oh no. Oh no. It's the cursed number. No. That means the LP curse is gonna happen 666 more times. Oh. Fooey on it. We're gonna do a precarious plateau. See? PP. Oh, jeez. Why did I pick that one to, to show an example for? Oh, whatever. Let's go up here for Rambi, because you're gonna need Rambi for this level. Also, you're gonna need to know how to get off of him. The best way to get off of him is just hold down and push one. I think that's actually the only way. But like I said, you need Rambi for this. To get all the puzzle pieces and to make the level a lot easier, like, really a lot easier. I think they put a checkpoint there just in case you don't hang Rambi. You can also destroy those spike balls with Rambi, which is always nice. And here's that. Here's a new bonus level, Shocker. I mean, really, we haven't we haven't really seen a new bonus level at all, and yet they throw one out for us. And there we go. I'm gonna check the picture. It's not frame skipping. Okay, it's not frame skipping. I thought I saw a frame skip. That's the problem with using Pinnacle Studio 14. It tends to want a frame skip, so, yeah. Some of you are like, why don't you get an HD PVR? Those things are awesome. Yeah, and they are also, they're also very expensive. I was never really interested in an HD PVR anyways. Since day one, actually. And I'm actually being honest with you, I haven't been interested in one since day one. It was the one thing that was probably different from me. I just stuck with Dazzle, usually. Okay. I didn't really see that guy, that Tiki, but that yeah, works for me. No, oh, right. There's this guy. Okay, this is not gonna last, so... Hurry! Up, bump! You still need Rambi, though. Like, you still need Rambi for most of the level, for all the unlockables. And there's the end of the level, actually. But remember, Rambi can't stand fire, so you gotta make sure you don't touch any fire. I don't know how much I have to say this, just to make sure you guys understand, but again, you can't use fire against Rambi, because Rambi will always lose against it. If that makes any sense, I probably made it, probably worded it wrong. Whatever. Anyways, here is a... The, um... A puzzle piece area that I really need to remember which one it is, because I always forget which one it is. But again, you can't hit Rambi with these fireball things. Otherwise, he just disappears automatically. He doesn't run away, he just disappears. Oh boy. I hate the ones that are really close. I'm pretty certain this is the one. Yeah. Get this one. I can't remember which one it was, so... I didn't think I was gonna grab that, but whatever! 29 minutes. Hmm. I'm doing actually pretty good time on this, actually. I wouldn't think so, but yeah, I'm doing actually a relatively good time. 